Hi, this is Dr. Arun Kannan, orthopedic surgeon from Apollo Hospitals, Chennai. In this video, I will talk to you about rheumatoid arthritis, more specifically about knee replacement for people with rheumatoid arthritis. Rheumatoid arthritis is an autoimmune condition, meaning the immune system of our own body acts against our own tissues. In rheumatoid arthritis, the body attacks the tissues in the joint and destroys them. When this happens, generally multiple joints tend to get involved. Many people with rheumatoid arthritis have simultaneous involvement of joints of the hands, elbows, shoulders, wrists, knees, ankles and even the hip joints. It generally is worse in the morning. People when they get up, they feel uh, stiff and it takes time for them to warm up and get going. It is usually diagnosed by clinical examination meaning when you come to us we check the joints check for swellings check for the movement in the joints and in addition we do some tests like rheumatoid factor and crp and diagnose this problem once the diagnosis is done treatment has to be started in the early stages before the joints are damaged this disease can be very well treated with medications there is a separate branch of medicine called rheumatology and there are many rheumatologists now even in Chennai who specialize in this treatment. They give medicines for a longer period of time to control this disease. This is something like diabetes meaning we cannot like give medicine for a few months and cure the disease completely but rather we have to maintain medications for a long time and keep the disease under control. If we have not done that, slowly the joints become damaged. The tissues in the joints become damaged. Frictionless movement in the joint is gone and it becomes secondary arthritis where the joint is fully damaged. Once the joint is fully damaged, unfortunately medications do not work. A very common unfortunate scenario that we come across is people initially ignore treatment. They think the medications will cause side effects and they don't take the medications and when the joints have become destroyed and medications will no longer work they come and try to treat this by taking medications without having to undergo surgery however once the opportunity to safeguard it in the first place is lost it is very difficult to recover what is already gone rheumatologists specialize in treating this so don't worry when they give medications take it properly however even Despite taking medications, if the disease progresses, the joints can become damaged or if you have not taken the medications properly, the joints can become damaged. So in this stage, the medicines won't work to cure the disease. Once the joint damage has happened, then surgery might be required. Commonly, hip joints and knee joints are the ones that become damaged so badly that they require surgery. Knee replacement for rheumatoid uh, patients is something that we do fairly often because we have a practice where there are six rheumatologists and they get a lot of rheumatoid arthritis patients and they get referred over to us when they require a joint replacement in the later stages. This requires certain modifications meaning the bones are weak and the soft tissues might be lax so we make certain modifications and do knee replacements for them. Similarly we can also do hip replacements for these people with very good results. It is almost similar to doing a regular knee replacement but with slight modification. And we get very good results. They are able to walk well, do most of their activities of daily living. I will give you the example of a 23 year old person. He had something called a juvenile arthritis similar to rheumatoid arthritis but the onset was in childhood. He started having the disease when he was 14. He was in Bangladesh and he could not take proper treatment. By 17 years of age, he had become wheelchair bound. Slowly, he became so bad that both his hips and knees became fused, meaning there was no movement in both knees and both hips. He came to us at the age of 23. Our rheumatologist saw him. He was beyond the stage where medications alone could affect or cure him. So he was sent over for joint replacement surgery. We successfully replaced both his hip joints, both his knee joints. He recovered 
slowly but steadily by 6 months to 1 year he was back to his activities of daily living he could go back to college and even recently got married so rheumatoid arthritis is a disease that affects multiple joints in earlier stages you must take the advice of a rheumatologist treat it properly with medicines in later stages once the joints have become damaged these are very well treated with surgery and they get a new lease of life thank you